Hey guys, and welcome back to another tutorial video, where today we're going to be revisiting my most viewed video ever, and it's been requested that I make an updated version for Windows 10 on Minecraft Cannot Resolve Hostname. So that's what we're going to do today. I won't talk too much more about it, let's just get straight into it. First, as always, start off looking at Boba Fett, he'll give you all the inspiration you need, and then you come down here to your search bar guys, and then you're just going to want to type in control panel it's a little bit different from my previous video I'm gonna bring up control panel then you're gonna go to network and internet view network and internet status and tasks okay and then you should see your Wi-Fi right here guys this is blurred out because it has some sensitive information but you'll see your internet right here and you'll know what it is and then what you're gonna want to do is go to change adapter settings right here again this is blurred out because it has a couple names in it all right but your Wi-Fi should be right here, not your Ethernet. Go to your Wi-Fi, you're gonna right click, and then you're gonna go down to properties. And then you're just gonna open this page right here, and you're gonna wanna scroll down to Internet Protocol version four. And then you're gonna double click on that. All right, so you're gonna open this, guys. It's gonna bring up this page, which should look familiar if you've seen my older video. So a lot of this is still the same. It was just the navigation that was different. And then you're going to want to put in these numbers. You're going to use the following IP address and you're going to enter these numbers. What you're going to go to is use the following DNS server addresses. This is fine. You can leave this blank, guys. What you're going to do is enter these numbers right here. I'll put them in the description as well. What you're going to do is enter this top number here and enter this number here. After that, you click validate settings upon exit and hit OK. That'll close out and save. All right, guys. And even though we've finished that now, and it should be all fixed and working, I'm going to throw in something a little bit extra for you. I'm going to show you a way to test if a server is still operational, because even if you did everything I said, if your server is no longer online, of course you're not going to be able to connect and it can't resolve hostname. So what I'm going to do is go down to the search bar again. You guys are going to type in CMD to get yourselves a nice command prompt like you see right here. And then you're simply going to type in ping and then paste a server that you think is operational. Paste your server address right here. It can be numbers, it can be words, just whatever server address you put in here is going to be what you're pinging. And then you hit enter. And as you can see, it is pinged. It has gotten a reply. It's pinged statistics for the server. And this is what you're looking for right here, guys. It pinged, packets sent four, packets lost zero, zero percent loss. That means your server address right here. This server is operational. And I'm gonna show you a quick little thing that means a server is not operational, just so you can compare. We're gonna go ahead and ping mineplex.com. There we go and the server is no longer operational, so we're gonna go ahead and ping it. And as you can see, it's taking a bit longer. This is request timed out. And Mineplex had multiple servers, so it's gonna do it again. And again. And one more time, one more time, yeah. All right, guys, so you see the difference. This server up here is operational. Packet sent four, received four down here server is not operational packets sent four received zero lost for a hundred percent loss so this means this server is no longer operational guys but this server is so this is just a quick neat little way to test if the server you're trying to connect to is operational at all or if it isn't because even if you use my trick guys that we went through earlier in the video and the server isn't out of your range it's just merely not working then that's going to be the reason you're getting the can't resolve host name all right Without further ado, I think that concludes our video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed me making an updated Windows 10 2020 edition to my old content that I made three years ago. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.